Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Unboxing, Demo, Review by Innovats Network on new interactive innovative technological products. Before we begin, make sure to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe for more such videos. Today, we are going to unbox and review one of the flagship models of digital writing pads from XP Pen called the XP Pen Deco 01 V2. XP Pen is one of the biggest brands for digital writing pads in the world. Well, let's immediately begin unboxing our new unit received from XP Pen. Wow, we just received a new unit. Waited for a few days for this actually. With a cup of coffee by my side, let's begin opening this box. This is the external packing cover used when the units are couriered to us. And voila, a blue and white box, Deco 01 V2. Now, let's remove the additional layer of plastic packaging. It's quite tightly packed with the plastic ensuring no damage to the box. Always check that the seal is not opened. If it's opened, it might be a used unit or a defective one. The designs on the main packaging looks artistic and cool, don't you think? So if we remove the box like this and when we open it, we get this writing pad inside another plastic cover. This is actually the main writing pad which we will be using today to write digitally on. Well, that looks sleek for a writing pad actually. So what accessories come with this box? There is a protective screen guard specifically for this model to protect the screen from any scratches due to constant use. Something unique which comes with this model is a pressure sensitive, battery free, passive stylus which comes with two configurable buttons on it. The design is similar to a normal pen. The grip on the stylus is actually smooth. For the stylus, there is a small stand which is given. We can place the pen vertically on the stand and keep it aside while not in use. At the bottom of the box, we find a plastic cover with few accessories in it. There is unique anti-fouling drawing glove which is very useful while writing on the pad. In the accessories packet, we get a pack of 8 replaceable pen nibs which can be replaced as and when the nibs become less effective and blunt while writing. There is a warranty policy as well as a quick guide. Most of the XP Pen writing pads come with a 1 year warranty. They also have a good responsive customer support team to help you out. There is a type C USB cable given for connecting your devices to the digital pad. You can connect your laptop or Android phone with this cable. There is also a USB to USB-C adapter, USB to micro USB adapter to help you with the connections. So now let's put the protector screen on the pad. Make sure to do so carefully such that it doesn't cover the buttons and no air bubbles are created inside the film. Using the Type-C cable given in the box, you can connect your XP Pen pad to the laptop like this. The Type-C port is on the left side of the pad. You will need a USB port in your laptop to connect through USB. Before we can use the pad, we have to install the drivers. For this, we have to go to the official XP Pen website xppen.co.in if you're an Indian user. XP Pen have so many models with them in digital pads. Select the model you are looking for specifically. Based on the operating system, download the relevant drivers onto your system. There are drivers for Mac operating system, Windows operating system, Linux, CentOS, Fedora and many more. After you download and install the drivers, it will ask you to restart your system. It's always recommended to restart your system for better user experience and functioning of the app. After you restart your system and open the XP Pen Penta Tablet app, you get an option to configure your writing area 
pen settings and customize your shortcut keys. You have an option to configure the 8 shortcut keys present on the left side of the tablet. It allows you to save a bit of time by not constantly having to use the laptop for performing few functions like scroll up, scroll down, erase, zoom in and zoom out. You can even customize the functions for the two buttons available on the stylus. Therefore, the stylus together with the pad can also be used as a cursor and a mouse. So now let's have a look at what kind of apps are compatible with XP Pen tablets. Yes of course, one of the main softwares widely used around the world for multi-purposes is the Microsoft PowerPoint from Microsoft. Using the inbuilt inking tools offered, we can definitely improve our presentation delivery and make our explanations more precise. Similarly, we can annotate, draw, highlight and explain on Microsoft Word documents as well. You can also check out the tools called Ink to Shape and Ink to Map. These are some unique tools to help you with content creation and delivery in the subjects of geometry and mathematics if you are a teacher. Another software very useful for content creation and delivery is Microsoft OneNote which is actually not so famous among the users of Microsoft apps. There are a lot more tools to utilize in this application for online teaching and presentations. Personally, I like to use this software a lot for my content creation and delivery. For those of you who wish to use whiteboarding softwares for online teaching or video conferencing, you can definitely bet for it on these writing tablets. Windows and Android applications such as Microsoft Whiteboard, Viewboard and Liveboard are some of the apps which work efficiently with XP Pen products. If you are an artist, animator, architect or a designer, this is the best product you can get hold of. The kind of accuracy you get along with the levels of pressure sensitivity is out of the world which makes it very helpful in getting the desired outputs. Some of the professional apps which are also compatible are Open Canvas, ArtRage, Easy Paint Tool SAI, Coral Painter, Adobe Illustrator, Photoshop, Effect, and also VC applications like Zoom, Teams, Cisco WebEx, and many more. Something what is special about this model is that you can also connect it to your Android mobile phone if it has a processor of Android version 6 and above. Well, most of the Android phones are above Android 10 currently, so I don't think it should be a problem. After downloading a compatible app from Google Play Store, you can connect your phone through Type-C cable from the box and also using the OTG adapter. What you were able to do on a Windows operating system can also be done even in Android mobile phones. Well, we have now come to the end of this video. I really do hope the information shared in this video was useful for you. For more details, please do get in touch with us. Damn.